Dawn Staley has recruited some of the game's best and kept them with the Gamecocks in the Portal era, where moving from one school to another is seemingly as easy and uncomplicated as an uncontested layup. The Gamecocks were number one throughout last season and were 36-0 before falling to Iowa in the national semifinals. They're looking up as the season begins in both the AP Top 25 and the Southeastern Conference predictions at national champion LSU. The Tigers feature dynamic Angel Reese and two of the top transfers of the offseason in Louisville's Haley Van Lith and DePaul's Anissa Morrow. Van Lith was a natural leader with the Cardinals while Morrow had 53 double-doubles in 66 games with the Blue Demons. Expect both to slide easily into LSU's starting lineup and form a super squad with Reese and Flau J. Johnson, who started every game as a freshman a year ago during the title-winning season. Count on a supercharged, SEC showdown when the Gamecocks visit LSU on January 25th. Staley's crafted what she expects to be a standout team of her own, bringing them in as freshmen and keeping players engaged and ready to step in when it's time. There are exceptions, like 6'7 Camila Cardoso, who was the ACC Freshman of the Year at Syracuse before joining Staley three seasons ago. Look for the base of this year's team to be the number one recruiting class from 2021 that features point guard Raven Johnson and forwards Bree Hall and Sanya Fijan. Staley hopes to have her inexperienced group primed and ready for SEC play after losing the core of team including Aliyah Boston and Zia Cook, who reached three straight Final Fours and won the 2022 championship. There's plenty of Cook and company the past couple of years especially if they can quickly find the team's typical form with a schedule that opens with the 6th-ranked Gamecocks facing No. 10 Notre Dame in Paris on November 6 before returning to play No. 12 Maryland, six days later. There are games in December with No. 16 North Carolina and No. 5 Utah before the start of SEC play. Hall, in her third season said being an underdog is a different role for her team, one they're ready for. For the love of the game, we hope you find a way to love the grind. We hope you find a way to, to love the disappointments. Well, I, I don't think I'm a coach that corrals them in and, and doesn't want them to play. Uh, you will hear me all the time say, go, run. You know, this, this is a game of entertainment. Let's go. If, if, if you're quick enough or you've got a first step that can blow by people, let's go. That's why I allow Angel. And now you see Samaya doing it. If those posts can take it off the rim and take off, I'm good with that. Samaya, SEC Media Day. Thank you for a great day. Amazing day. Job well done.